While the Republican Party showed up for Super Tuesday in record numbers as a heated race continues for the Republican presidential nomination, voters are making sure their voices are heard at today's caucus. Logan Gay is live in our Brainerd studio after she stopped by the caucus events in Baxter. Logan? Yes, this year's Republican caucus was definitely one for the history books. With candidates like Marco Rubio, Donald Trump, and Ted Cruz, Minnesotan voters definitely wanted to feel like they had a seat at the table. I visited the Baxter caucus to find out which candidate they would be supporting. Hundreds of people ready to participate in this year's presidential election attended the Republican caucus at Forest View Middle School. The crowd this year broke records from previous years. At the moment it's a little chaotic and people have a lot of questions and we're trying to help them as best we can. But that's not necessarily new, but we're doing the best we can with the huge volume of people that are here. Many participants attended the caucus hoping their support will make a difference in the outcome of the election. I think that the Republican Party has a lot of great candidates and a lot of people are taking an interest in that and I also believe that uh, people are being motivated by uh, a recent past politically that they're not happy with. Voters mentioned several issues throughout the evening. Really at the top of the list is what's happening in Minnesota in regard to taxes and federal, of course, federal taxes are going to play into that. And then an issue like I just mentioned, the Supreme Court is on people's mind. Uh, I think it's fair to say that social issues play into this. There's people that are looking and they have their values on their sleeve and they care passionately about those things. Although there was support for each candidate, many already have their predictions about who will win the nomination. My gut tells me is that Senator Cruz and Senator Rubio will do very well in Crow Wing County and probably all across the 8th District. I talked to a volunteer at the caucus who has volunteered for over 24 years, and he said they have not seen this amount of attendees since 1988. All right, well, thank you very much, Logan, for that live report from our Brainerd studio tonight. They also discussed the upcoming Crow Wing County Republic Convention on March 19th, which will be held at Central Lakes College. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.